The Truth According to Arthur by Tim Hopgood and David Tazziman. This is Arthur and this is the truth. Arthur and the truth are not the best of friends right now because today this happened which caused this and also this. The truth was Arthur knew he'd done wrong because his mum had told him he wasn't to ride his brother's big bike. So when his friend Noah asked what, had hap what was happening, Arthur tried bending the truth just a little bit. This super cool princess asked if she could have a go on my brother's bike. She'd never, ever ridden one before. And bashed into my mum's car. She didn't even say sorry. Uh-oh, I bet your mum's going to be really cross, said Noah. Hmm, that wasn't exactly what Arthur wanted to hear. So, when his friend Lula asked him what had happened, Arthur tried stretching the truth instead. I was just having a little go on my brother's bike when an alien asked if he could borrow it. He said he needed it to get home. I think he thought it would fly. <gasps> Uh-oh, I bet your mum's not going to be very pleased, sighed Lula. That wasn't exactly what Arthur wanted to hear either. Arthur decided that more drastic action was needed. He tried covering up the truth, disguising it, hiding it, but it refused to stay covered up or disguised or hidden. So, when little Frankie asked Arthur what had happened, Arthur decided to just ignore the truth altogether. It has nothing to do with me. My brother's bike just transformed into a giant robot and mum's car did too. And there was a huge fight. And mum's car won. Cool, said little Frankie. I bet your mum will be pleased about that. Um, I hope so, said Arthur. Arthur, it was mum. Time for Arthur to face the truth. He looked the truth square in the eye. The truth looked back. Arthur, do you have something to tell me? Asked his mum. What will Arthur do? What would you do? Well, Arthur said something that surprised even him. It was me. I did it. Sorry. And that turned out to be all right, actually. Although Mum wasn't too happy about her car and the bike, she was pleased that Arthur had told her the truth. So, what started out as a bad day finished up being a good day for Arthur. The... Oh, and now Arthur... And the truth are the best of friends. And Arthur never rode his brother's big bike again. Well, not anywhere near his mum's car. The end.